know once again, how do you do? Uh, first of all, I would like to thank you, all the viewers, because you made the things possible. As I hear that there are a lot of you who are watching, that motivates me, and I post a lot. I hope sometimes that I feel that uh, maybe it's too much, but the good thing of this technology is that you can easily skip it if you don't prefer to watch. And today's topic would be the money, and I would like to give a simple mathematical example at the end, so let's get started. So again, <coughs> I will put this here, uh, put uh, the right angle, and uh, yes, the money. First, we know that the money probably appeared a tens of thousands of years ago uh, in the form of maybe shells or, or stones or whatever. Uh, they were even writing down uh, on the stone or in clay something. And we know that later came in the forms of precious metals, gold, silver, and so on, and the kings or the rulers were often put their picture for propaganda of course of themselves. And the interesting thing was that when they discovered America and they, there was a lot of gold in America and it was a gold rush, you probably heard of this, and this caused an inflation in Europe because suddenly it was too much commodity and everything was set on the gold. You know about the gold standard, those who are studying economy or are good informed or educated. Um, and then uh, were invented IOU and I was reading about this that it was invented in China firstly and firstly IOU was connected to gold standard and then later in 1970s there is no more gold standard anymore because we, as the population rise, we need more and more money, so it's impossible to set it with the gold standard anymore. <coughs> That's what I want to say about the money. And the last example, what I have in mind, is imagine that at the first day of the month, you get one dollar or one euro, it doesn't matter. And then next day, you double this. So you have two euro. And then next day, the third day, you doubled again from the previous day. So we have four, then eight, 16, 32, and so on. And then we would like to calculate how much do you think you will have at the end of the month if the month is, let's say, 30 days long. <coughs> if you put this in your calculators, you will put two to the power of 30. So if you put this, you will see that the number you get is a little more than a billion dollars. So not bad. And if you try to think how much is, if you will do this whole year, you will be probably the richest man in the world. So thank you. And I would also like to thank my sponsor. You know who they are, Bill with Melinda Gates, Mark Zuckerberg, Priscilla Chan, and also others. So uh, you'll see the program and you'll see who we are. It's not just me. So I would like to thank my team too for good things they are providing to us. Thank you again.